Heck yeah, it's a creepy album cover. I mean, yeah. it's unfortunate, but it's just that's the way life is um, for a lot of people. I was, well, I'm actually kind of falling victim to it myself. Uh, the more you work and the more you think about trying to provide a living and working hard, you kind of neglect other areas of life. So this album actually came out in 2004, but I didn't know about this band until around 2009 or so. And when I got into fitness and stuff, it kind of clicked like, wow, yeah, there's people that they utilize a lot of their time to train and they kind of sacrifice working hard. And I'm not saying working hard as far as training, but I mean, working hard as far as like putting their their entire effort and time and ethic and everything into working, making money. Instead, they're doing it towards training and fitness and making their body tip top shape. Not saying that hard work doesn't achieve that even in the corporate world because you have to be able to sustain eating right, which generally costs money. Yeah, if you have your own land and you hunt your own animals or maybe if you're a vegetarian or vegan or something, you can get by, but Basically, from my experience, it's if I'm doing one thing, I'm neglecting other areas of my life. So when I was doing marathon running and everything, it was just rough because like I would spend so much of my time just focusing. Like, I was still working too, but I would spend all my money on organic food and new pairs of shoes every few weeks because I keep destroying them and stuff like that. So that's pretty much what I prioritized. So it's kind of interesting looking at this album cover this, you know, chubby guy, lost his identity, like, who am I anymore? But I kind of have that tie around my neck, which, looking at it now, it actually doesn't look like a tie. Back then, I would kind of see it as him wearing a tie like he's a business guy. I don't know, that's kind of funny now that I'm looking at it kind of close up. And far away, it just gives that image of a tie. Anyway, it's already been two minutes. Holy crap, let's just get into this song. Freaking Cypher System, I love this band. They needed to make more stuff. Uh, the song's called Complete, so let's complete the intro, which I'm not even, even though I made an intro, I'm too lazy to even put it on there. Let's go. Let's complete this song. It's so melodic. This was definitely ahead of its time, wasn't it? It doesn't even sound like it came from 2004. To be honest, whenever I punched this in and I seen it said 2004, I'm like, really? Man, I was thinking at least 2007, 2008, because again, I figured out this band and who they were in 2009. And then they had another album after this, which is really good. Really, really good. Um, but yeah, Central Tunnel 8, this album is just awesome. But for 2004, it's just definitely ahead of its time. I mean, just those, it has those metalcore riffs and structure and just the vocal is just on point. Just, just the overall feel and vibe of the song. So good. Good. You, 
the way it ended. It didn't really end that way. Whoever uploaded this, they ended it that way. You have such great taste in bands, we should be friends. <laughs> My goodness. Um, yeah. Pretty underknown, but if you click on them, they got some stuff. Communicate the Storms is the newer album, but that was pretty much, see, nine years ago for that. Sheesh. So freaking good. Um, yeah. Just those two albums, and it's like, what the heck happened? And there's so many bands that do that. Like, they'll come out with one album, maybe two tops, and then you never hear from them again. It's just depressing. It's like, why? I mean, I understand life happens, stuff happens, but like, I would love if they made a comeback. It would be insane. It's pretty much it for me. Uh, thanks for watching. If you have any other suggestions for me for music like this or really any type of metal or any type of content, definitely post it in the comment section below. As always, may the Lord Jesus Christ bless you. Have a fantastic day, and I'll see you in the next one.